Morning guys. Ah, just getting ready to go. It's still kind of foggy. The fog is lifted, but uh, still a bit foggy. Morning. Hi. How you doing? Fine, how are you? Fantastic. We're gonna try and get out of here, get across the island. Uh, the weather's better on the other side of the island, on the east side, so we're gonna probably go coastline around the island and then hopping over to Faroe Islands. Weather's better over there, 1,600 foot ceiling, still not awesome. We gotta get out of this weather and get into the sunshine. I'm looking forward to getting some warm weather and sunshine, but uh, for now, we are fueled. We're following our flight plan, getting out of here. Let's go. That is steam over there. Yep. Wow. Man, the countryside here is just so diverse and amazing. Just all from crazy volcanic ash, or not ash, uh, <laughs> activity. <laughs> well, this, like... part, this part, guys, don't just forget, okay? It was not ash, okay? Shh. Make sure it's just vapor. Vapor. But it, Misha wants to make it really tense. It's ash coming out. <laughs> it's flames. <laughs> <laughs> Look at all the steam from the, uh, from all the, <laughs> the hot water. <laughs> I can't even think now. Oh my goodness. <laughs> This is amazing, wow. <laughs> I like this road, look at the road. Yeah. There's such good infrastructure here in Iceland. Eh? Yes, they made a good job. Yeah, ago. they sure did. Look at that highway there. Yeah. Crossing the country, just like Greenland. The infrastructure Greenland. is amazing. <laughs> yeah, just like Greenland. <laughs> the infrastructure is a little better here than uh -huh. Greenland. Greenland's beautiful, but the, this is a little more civilized feeling. It's, uh, you can smell it's the Diogo's favorite you, country. Yeah, I know. Diogo, what are you thinking of your favorite country at the moment? Uh, as beautiful as always. Yeah, favorite <laughs> as, as always. As always. <laughs> you can smell the sulfur in the air. You can? Yeah, you You're can. You're very sensitive now. No, you can't smell that? No. This really? crossing here? Oh, there's a, a runway down here. Oh, yeah, a little uh, grass strip. This crossing what? Uh, no, here to the right, you go north. Yep. And down there, that's Reykjavik. To the right? Way. You mean to the left? To the left, the other right. Re right there is Reykjavik. Oh, that's Reykjavik, okay. Yes. Cool. Well, this is neat. This is like the open territories of Iceland here. This is where you can get these uh, these big overland vehicles. And then down here, you can sort of see there's these paths kind of working their way through the countryside here. And so they take these massive vehicles with huge wheels and stuff. And they drive through these backcountry areas, just in the wilderness and up the mountains and stuff take people on these crazy driving adventures. That looks so amazing, man. Look at this, like that road just going across that little canyon down there. Wow. And then the massive ice cap. Could you imagine driving up that ice cap? Have you guys ever done a tour like that or no? No? That would be so cool. We drove to the top of the mountain that looks like that. That's cool. No, that's ice But not, no. not in the ice though. No. Like that. Wow. Uh, ice cap is also there, isn't it? Yeah, there's multiple. There's one here, there's one over there, and then there's another one far in the distance that way over there. Yeah, so amazing. Where did you go? Look at that. Volcanic activity right there. Yes. We got some steam rising from the hot springs. Oh, that's so cool. Usually that water is yeah. at uh, 300 degrees, wow. 380. But look at that pool right there. That's a hot pool right there on the top of the mountain. You see that? There's steam coming off of that. You could go sit in that and have ice like around you. Oh, this is so cool. Down over this way, there's like this big canyon. Carve this way through here. It's uh, Charlie Gulf Sierra Hotel Uniform. Charlie Gulf? That's a Canadian zero. aircraft. No. He said Hotel. Charlie Gulf. But something, no. I don't know. Expect Isla Zulu runway 19. That's cool. Is possible? Can we re request the RNAV runway 19? We're going to fly over the edge of this ice cap here. Well, this isn't one of the big ice caps, but we are flying over an ice cap. Blue sky above. We didn't get to do this in Greenland, so we're going to do it in Iceland. Ah, this is nice. Check out this terrain down here. This is so cool. I mean, we're quite high, so it's hard to see the definition, but there's just some really cool rock structures and formations and stuff down here. <coughs> this is very neat. I love the color, man. It's just so black. Oh, that's really cool. And you were saying in the summertime, this is all full of colors, right? Yeah, it changes There's a like lot reds because and you get greens, greens and, and, and reds and different flowers. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. That would be so cool to Moss. see. Moss look is a big thing. Look at that giant ice fjord right there. Well, I, I guess they don't call it a fjord, right? But look over there, Ruben. 
Yep. You see that Thank ice you. all slowly coming down? Well, I guess, yeah, the big ice cap. We are back in the lowlands again, and the colors are starting to come just a little more here. 2,500 feet, though. 2,500 feet is still fairly high, but back in the lowlands compared to 6,000 something, we were back there. 7,000 almost. Oh, man. Yeah, yeah. That's our broken there, 4,000. Yeah, that's our broken, exactly. That's what the weather is. Man, today worked out to be such a better day than I expected it to be. When we left uh, Ezra's house, it was completely fogged in still. Like it was, it had lifted slightly overnight, but hardly. As we were driving, it started to lift quite a bit more. And then when we left uh, the airport, we uh, could obviously see some open open patches. We were able to fly and it's just like blue sky and we popped above and it was just like really, really nice there. So. That was very good. Glad that that happened, and this is just phenomenal. And then it's supposed to be decent over to Faro. Um, 1,600 foot ceilings in Faro, so not like incredible, but definitely decent. Check out the farming. This is a nice valley, wow. I bet you this would be an awesome river for like rafting down. It actually reminds me just a tiny bit of like Lillooet, that valley. And we're just coming down into the town of Eglestada and it is beautiful it's getting all green they got trees down here and this is a nice valley it's a big inlet that comes out from the ocean over there and uh, this town here kind of reminds me of a little something you'd find in switzerland or something it's really nice here and i'm i'm seeing really nice terrain looks like on the back side of this hill right here it's about to drop down into just a couple of cliffs not really cliffs um but just beautiful terrain oh, i can actually smell the trees right now Oh, that's a good smell. I like that. This is a beautiful, picturesque little town here. It's almost, now it's almost feeling a little bit more, yeah, like Switzerland or like uh, Banff or something. It has that little bit of a, a Banff type feel to it. This is just really, really nice. We are just getting some fuel here in Egelstada. This place is really nice. I really like the vibe here. It's, um, yeah, it's, it's, it's got lots of greenery, but yet it's still rugged and remote. Beautiful little place. I like it so far. Temperature's really warm. I'm actually roasting in this suit right now. It's pretty hot. Um, first time, actually, we're getting hot in these suits, which is really nice. And uh, so we're just gonna make this stop as quick as possible. Gotta get customs cleared before we leave here. Kind of interesting, customs clearance before you leave the country. I'm not sure why that is, but anyways, first country we've had that. And then a uh, quick hop over the uh, ocean to Faroe Islands. Hopefully get there by a reasonable time. We have a conference at 6 o'clock there tonight with the university. So really looking forward to that. Goodbye, Iceland. I'm going to miss you. This is our last ridge here before we hop out over the ocean and head off to Faroe Islands. It's been beautiful. I'll be back. You've been wonderful. Thank you. <laughs> There's a nice little town down there. Wow, that's really cool. Yeah, it's pure. Oh, man, that's really, really nice. Hanging out in that town would be very cool. We're just going to hop over this ridge, and this is the last one to drop out into the ocean. Okay, one last goodbye. We got more ridge after ridge after ridge, and more amazing towns, more incredible scenery. If you guys haven't been to Iceland before, you probably want to put it on your list of places to go, because this place is amazing. I'm bringing my family back here. Amy, we're coming back. <laughs> <laughs> we are coming back. Look at that. We're going to drive around Iceland and rent one of those cool vehicles and drive around Iceland. And you can rent mine. All this. Yeah, I could rent yours. That's true. $4,000 a day. When, uh, when are you going to have it? I could give you a discount. Not for free. No. Well, if it's not being used, I can give it for free. 3000 uh, 3000 a day. How's that sound? Okay, let's break even. Three, 35 35 Okay, 35 <laughs> Fine. <laughs> You're, it's a good you drive. Deal. You drive a hard bargain, but oh, I'll man. take it. I'll take it. When's, when's your vehicle, vehicle going to be available? Hopefully six uh, months. Next spring. So spring. Okay, spring, Amy. Spring. Nice. Okay, I think we're finally going to hit the ocean once we get past this final ridge line. <laughs> I just don't want to stop showing you guys how amazing this is. Okay, I won't. I'll just keep showing you guys. <laughs> Wow. I uh, I always say this, but the camera just really doesn't do it justice how Look beautiful it is. Look at this side, is. Yoko. Wow. <laughs> Amazing. 
The coast of Iceland. Look at this. There's yeah. the little house there. Look at that little house. Oh, that is so cool. Ooh. Right down Ooh, there. Look at that house, man. I don't know, but I want to live there. Ooh. Oh, wow. Imagine waking up to that every morning. That's really amazing. And like that's your morning exercise. You just hike from down there at the bottom of the valley up to that ridge line. You look around uh -huh. 360 and then you hike back down. Oh, 10 minutes up, bro. 10, 10 minutes, minutes up, 10 minutes up down. Wow, you're a fast yeah. climber. Yeah, yeah. Very easy. <laughs> All right. Whatever you say there. Okay, guys, it's <laughs> gonna be a El Capi. It's gonna be a sick passage here, guys. Be ready. A sick, sick passage. Amazing. Wow. Ready, Diogo. Be ready. Diogo, are you ready? It's gonna be a sick Your passage. Dad wants you to be ready. I'm ready. Baby, get ready. Oh yeah, we got some black sand oh, beaches this is down there. Sick. Oh, that's not black. No, I know it's not black, but. You know, just trying to make it dramatic sounding. Uh, <laughs> okay, you're right. Wow. <laughs> There's a Compa place in compared Iceland. to the Caribbean, this is black. <laughs> There's a place in Iceland called, well, you don't say it like this, but Americans call it <laughs> US, pe US people. Oh, that's right. Speak look, at this, look at this. Look at this. Look at this. What that guy they, has a what carpet. Say, English speaking people call it stokeness. Stokeness. But it's not it's not that's not how you say it in Icelandic, nope. but it's a place called Stokeness and you yep. you'll be stoked. There. Oh stokeness. It's incredible. Nice. Yes. I'm in, I'm stoked right now. <laughs> this is stoking me up. It has a carpet. This pla this valley has a carpet. This valley is carpeted. The carpeted valley. Oh, that's a good I think thing. we need to wash the bubble because it's very dirty, yeah. and it's not doing this beauty justice. Why didn't we wash the bubble at the Ezra's house? Wash the bubble because we didn't have the helicopter at Ezra's house. I wanted that answer. Thank you very <laughs> much. I was expecting that answer. Yeah. That and was the only reason. We also were only at Ezra's house for a very short few hours, and it was foggy, and the helicopter was not there. So I don't know if that's enough reasons, but probably. You know what? Tomorrow, we're going to be flying to Scotland, and Scotland's going to look a lot like this. Is it? I'm excited about that. Yeah, it is. It's and oh, look at this epic! Look at that, guys! Incredible. Look at this! Oh uh, yeah, it's a little bit scary. No, it's not scary. scary. It's exciting! Look at this! Woo! Ha <laughs> ha! Wow, that is a coastline. Look at this! Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa! What is Nobody this? Nobody gets to see this. What is this? Nobody sees this. You can't drive back here. There's no road. No. Oh, wow. what is this? Whoa! Oh man, I gotta get a, p a picture. Look at the water. Can you can you film the water? Wow. Why, why do you film the water? Because the water's right there, nice. The contrast. But no, now you're oh, dipping left, I can't word. see a thing. This is amazing. <laughs> okay, let's get on track. Got to go this on track, so guys. Amazing. Bye bye, Iceland. We got to get on track. Look at that, Misha Gelb. Goodbye, Iceland. Look at this weather. It's amazing. And that's the way we're going to Faroe Islands. There it is, you guys. <laughs> There's the land right there that we can see. Little island right there is better definition. And then we can see the outline of that island right there. We are arriving at the Faroe Islands and there's a little fisherman over here. Can you guys see him? Yep, right there. Okay, you guys, I missed getting that on the, on the camera, but our clearance that we just got is you're cleared in via the waterfall. Now, if any of you guys know the Faroe Islands, the most famous thing you can see here is the major waterfall that comes down off the cliff into the ocean. We just got clearance to come in via the waterfall. I'm looking forward to seeing this. This is what it's looking like so far here in the Faroe Islands. It looks exactly like the photos, except in real life, it's way bigger and way more amazing. So we were told that in the Faroe Islands, they have crazy tunnels. And I didn't think it was anything this serious, but look at this, you guys. There's a tunnel right there that goes through this mountain to the other side. That's a crazy tunnel, man. And it's just to supply this little town. If you can call that a town, it's like, 15 houses. That is crazy. There it is. Wow. That's the that's the waterfall? No, that's, that's the, not that's the, the waterfall. I think that's one of the famous ones. That's a waterfall that is really amazing. Wow, look at this coast, man. Whoa, you wouldn't oh, want to come see, sliding down do that you hill. you see the runway there? Yeah, I see the runway. Wow, 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 wow. This coastline, can you imagine driving that road? Are we gonna, we're gonna get we're gonna get a ride 45 yeah. minutes across Faro 
we're gonna get to ride on one of these roads. Oh, I'm looking forward to that. So the university is coming to pick us up. Not the waterfall, is it? There's no. a little waterfall. No, this is not it. I think we, we probably, must have passed it. We probably had, should have gone that way. I don't know. Yeah, maybe. Who knows? Yeah. Amazing. Wow. This approach this is, is interesting. So cool. Actually, this departure is kind of weird, huh? Yeah. Look at this little European town in the Faroe Islands. Oh, I love towns like this, man, so much. And then here's the runway. I love the shape. It like dips hardcore off the end there. You see that? So cool. Huh, interesting. The wind's on the windsock showing opposite than what he just told us. Yeah. He said 180, which is like that way over there. Interesting. Very nice little terminal, though. That's cool. Vagar. That's neat. I can't believe it, man. We are in the Faroe Islands right now. Wow. This is super, super surreal. There's an H there. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's probably where we're going. Urban Diaz is very excited right now. We have arrived at Faroe Islands. How excited are you, my friend? One more! Woo! Faroe One dance. More. Let's Faroe do Islands. the Faroe dance. Faroe Come on, let's do the Faroe dance right here. Faroe Islands! Woo! Faroe dance! Yeah, in front of our handler. Let's see. Urban, see if you can get her to do a Faroe Island dance. Faroe Island! <laughs> She's excited. Yeah, we made it! Woo! She's excited. <laughs> Uh, How you doing? Hey. Misha. I, nice I to meet you. Alright, the baby is packed away for the night. All tied down, ready to go. Let's get inside, get some internet. And we gotta go file a uh, GAR over to the UK. We gotta get that done. We'll get over to our hotel. This is it. Well, this is cute. Let's get everything loaded in here, get going. Alright, I gotta say, man. Things are expensive here, but these guys, Let me tell you what, where are they? 62 North right there. These guys were fantastic. It's like 250 bucks a day, but they gave us for how much? 145, 143. That's not bad, we just save our dinner. It's amazing. We can All right. have dinner tonight, guys. Woo, we can eat. Wow, we yeah, can eat. Let's eat, let's, let's do go. it. Woo. We are in Faroe Islands, driving along, checking out the countryside. Hey, there's sheep. Sheep, I uh, see sheep. That is going to have a sheep. I'm going to have an sheep. entire sheep. You so hungry? Yeah, I'm so hungry, I'm going to pet a sheep. <laughs> pet a sheep. <laughs> I don't eat sheep. Come on now. So we got to eat before the conference. Yes, we got to eat right away. We got all kinds of stuff to do. But we got rocket roof filed. We got our GIR done. We got our flight plan filed already. Yeah. That's helpful. Everything's done. That's very nice. Hey, listen, it's rocking. Look yeah. at this town. Oh, man. This is like, this is totally a European town, eh? European, but yet Pharaoh. <laughs> Pharaoh. <laughs> it's nice. People here are super nice, eh? Yeah. Everybody we've met so far have been awesome. I wonder what the winters are like here. I think they're pretty mild. Or super harsh. Super windy, from what I understand. Yeah, this is this is a lot like what Scotland looks like. Very similar. Oh, so nice. These roads are so cool too. Just winding their way through here. They're here from Copenhagen. In Copenhagen. Copenhagen. In Reykjavik. In Reykjavik. That's it? Really? That's it? Copenhagen and Reykjavik? Yep. Wow. How much does it cost to get from Vancouver to Copenhagen? Oh, no, you fly from Vancouver to Reykjavik. You fly Wow Air. Vancouver Reykjavik? Yeah, yeah, we can do that. Wow Air. Wow Air. This is a cool tunnel. <laughs> I think we are definitely <laughs> headed for the antipode right now. Is this the, we left Neva. We flew for a while, and now we are traveling through the Earth to the antipode in Indonesia. Hey guys, we don't need to fly there. No, we don't need to fly. Just we can just this tunnel. drive through the earth in this tunnel. And a half an tunnel. hour later, we are on the other side. So let's cross another couple oceans. We're gonna have I'm one more to win. You're missing it already? I'm missing it already. We just I'm did it like an hour ago. 
You're missing it. I'm, cro- I'm missing crossing the oceans. I'm well, going to miss it big time. Well, I think I'm going to go back to Vancouver. I'm going to fly all day long to Vancouver Island back Vancouver and forth. Vancouver Island and back. Get to the land, go back. Go to the land, back. <laughs> well, you know what? If you don't give the, uh, if you don't sell the, the, the raft and everything, huh? you could just keep it all and then you could fly over water as much as you want. You got True. floats, you got a life True. raft. I'm not going to sell it. You got life I don't jackets. Think I'm going to sell it. No? Why not? Why Come would I sell? I'm going to Alaska. It's true. I don't know. It's true. Right? It's true. Why would I sell? I don't know. I like the suits. It's true. The suits. Might are come nice. back to Greenland. We might have Typhoon. a trip in one year. It's right? True. Yeah. Come back. Doesn't make sense. Yeah. yeah. Greenland in a year. That sounds like a good plan. Oh, we're out on the coast. We're getting to the point, aren't we? <laughs> we've Where been are we? we've been beating around the bush. Let's just get to the point. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. There's the point. That's where we're going. That is where our town is. And I think the hotel is in the opposite direction on the other side of the island. I think we're going the wrong way right now. Yeah. Very. And vegetation now. These ta- like, like, like these houses have like a yard and vegetation. This is the first... Looks like a oh, this is interesting. I'm trying to think back now. This is the first place we've been to in a long time that has houses with a yard. When was the last time we saw a place that has a house with a yard? Quebec City. Probably. Quebec, right? City. Yeah, I think so, right? Yeah. Like Iceland, the they don't have a yard. I mean, they have like lava around them, True. but they don't have like a, a green yard. Like these people have Same a yard. Thing, but we didn't see That's that. so weird. The pool. So we're having troubles finding a hotel because it's actually hiding. Sorry, it's in the side of the mountain. And can, can anybody pronounce it? It's Hotel Foyer, right? I don't even know the name. Foyer. It's Foyer. 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 It's a hotel foyer, and it's in the side of the mountain. It's actually dug into the mountainside, and so that's why we can't find it, because it's hiding. It'll be in there. But the map is going to show us how to get there, so it's okay. Do not fear. Look at oh, Everybody's got green roofs. I love this. I'm pretty sure... Green roofs and solar, man. That's like the way to go. It's fantastic. It is. Green roof insulates the, the building. Solar gives you the power and much time, man. Hydro. We're very tight on time now. Is it? Yeah. Oh, man. We're gonna starve. We're not gonna be able to eat. And eat something. Oh, eat something. man. So our conference is in about uh, 25 minutes. We're trying to get a bite to eat. We've been running around trying to find a good place. This place looks really nice. She's gonna make an avocado sandwich for us. So we're gonna have a bite to eat real quick, then head over to the university. All right, we have made it here to the university. Hello, how are you? I'm Misha. Welcome nice to meet here. you. Yeah, thank you, thank you. Hi. Great to be Hi. here. Hi. Nice to see you. Nice to see you. <laughs> in the world, they say. Is it? The second largest sail ship in the world? Yes. Oh, man. And uh, well, sure. people are visiting it right now. Wow. Uh-huh. That's beautiful. Going to be right. in Cagliari. Yeah. So this is the hall that they have booked for us. This is amazing. A little bit of a side note here, but this is for Amy. Amy, look at this floor. Isn't that beautiful? Amy loves the herringbone, the herringbone floors. The view is nice, right in the harbor. He was saying this used to be a fish factory, and uh, they've converted it now into university, and it's done an amazing job. It's really nice. Well, that went really good. They, uh, I think they enjoyed it. A smaller group than normal, but it was still fun. We're gonna go head back now. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. It is super exciting to be here in Faroe Islands. Man, it's hard to keep track of all the places we are. Faroe Islands. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Talk to you guys again tomorrow.